Okay, we have stage 11, Chris Froome, 2016 Velt. So I can't use any video footage because the Velt, the, the copyright, all this shit's just they don't understand fair usage laws and I don't have to go to court and sue them and all that stuff and I just don't have time worries for that. Anyway, Chris Froome, let's have a look at these motherfucking photos. Chris, here's his head down. He's doing it so easy. Chris Froome is so next level. He can put his head down and shunt his breathing cycle every few seconds. Look at Quintana. Quintana has the pain face on, which he rarely, 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 rarely uses. Chris Froome has his head down in the saddle. Quintana is in the jersey, has the, the red jersey wings, smashing it. Chris Froome spinning. And Chavez, see that down there? Chavez gave the stage away. He was grinding up the mountain, grinding up there. Chris Froome's going to win this Velter. He's, in my opinion, he is just like, like, look look, look at the face. Chavez, uh, Quintana's still gassed. Froome's like, yeah, I got this in the bag. Chris Froome is next level. Next level. And just like I said, no one's going to come close to Froome. If, if Froome doesn't win this year, the Velta, it's because he gave the race away. Because he felt sorry for Quintana. He's got it in the bag, just like I said he would. And all you haters who say, grind, grind, grind. You got Chris Froome. He's like 15 kilos or 20 kilos heavier than Quintana. You know? And he's dropping him in the saddle. <laughs> You know, like, this is how next... And he's got his head down half the fucking time. This is how next level Chris Froome is. He has no competition. No competition. Now, if these guys did more spinning, they could get up there to Chris Froome's level. But in the stage racing, if you're not spinning, you ain't winning shit. you got to spin to win. So all these guys have similar blood values, etc. Because you can't be up there. You can't push that watts per kilo and not have similar blood values. You know, this is how it works. The enzymes, the, all that stuff. You know, the hemoglobin. Um, it comes down to who's got the better strategy. Who's spinning to produce less fatigue metabolites? You heard it here first. Spinning. Actually, Dr. Ferrari told me that one via email. I've been talking to Dr. Ferrari. I said quite a while ago. But he just says you produce less fatigue metabolites spinning. And he gave me some little charts. Like, okay. So you got Chavez here. Gun ride. Gave the stage away. Grinding. So, like, Matt White, no offense, but put down the fucking meat pies. Pick up a fucking vegan lentil pie. And put some fucking, put a 32% on Chavez's bike. So he can actually get some power. Like, it's 2016. Chris Froome's got his washing machine spinning right past. Crazy. Chris Froome, no competition. Just like I said, man. Just like I said. Next level. And you can see it because he's got his mouth closed. He's in the fucking saddle. He's got his head down. And he's still got his mouth closed there. Across the line. Not even gasping. Not even gasping. Mouth shut. Mouth still shut. Doing the Lance Armstrong salute. Remember that cowboy won Lance in 2001 out to Wes? Chris Froom, no competition. Just like I said, comments down below. Thanks for watching. Carbs, carb the fuck up, motherfuckers. Carb the fuck up. Corn, rice, potatoes, yams, bananas, mangoes, dates, plantain, melons, blueberries, blackberries, moles. Get them motherfucking carbohydrates in. Go vegan, motherfuckers. Carb the fuck up, the fuck up, the fuck up, the fuck up.